warm welcome from Filter Concept. Sugar, an essential part of our daily lives, is produced through a complex manufacturing process. The process involves harvesting sugar canes or sugar beets, and then going through a series of steps such as washing, juice extraction, filtration, crystallization, centrifugation, drying, and packaging. The first stage of the sugar manufacturing process is the harvesting of sugar cane or sugar beets, which are then loaded onto trucks and taken to the factory. Once the raw material arrives, it is washed to remove dirt and rocks with a water spraying belt and a rotating drum. For sugar canes, the material is crushed by a roller crusher and then soaked in hot water, while sugar beets are sliced into small strips known as sugar cassette and then also soaked in hot water. Both processes are used to swell the plant cells for juice extraction. The cassette will be pumped by a rotating shaft and the sugar cane will be gone through a milling process by the 5 mils compressor which helps to separate the juice from the bagasse. Both processes are done for extracting juice. The juice extracted will be dark green in color and acidic and turbid or cloudy in the first stage. After extracting the juice, it will be transferred into vats and then the sugar concentration will be measured from it. By following juice extraction, juice purification is processed by adding juice from the top of the tank and adding filtered sulfur dioxide vapor from the bottom of that same tank. The carbonation will be added for separating the non-sugar material from the juice and the juice will be heated. The slurry of calcium hydroxide will be added to it. In the clarification process, the juice will be removed from the top of the tank and sludge is removed from the bottom of the tanks and then the sludge will be filtered to extract the remaining sugar. By following the clarification process the concentration process will proceed, in which the juice will be filtered and boiled in high vacuum evaporators until it reaches the relevant concentration of sugar, and then sugar syrup boiling at a lower temperature. With the use of a paddle skimmer, the sediment will be removed from the top of the layer, and make the syrup thicker and colorless syrup by this method. After that filtration process is needed for removing unwanted dirt and bacteria. The syrup is then evaporated by adding sucrose, which is a suspended solution of alcohol and glycerin, and the sugar will spread in the solution and convert into sugar crystals. The sugar crystals will be formed as a paste which is known as mask white. This mask white is a mixture of sugar crystal and sugar syrup and then it will be transferred to a crystallizer machine where it is stirred and cooled. The mask white is then transferred to centrifuge equipment to separate the sugar crystals from the syrup. The separation will be sent out after the spring water will be done by centrifuge. The sugar crystals are dried using hot air dryers and separated into different sizes through vibrated screens. Finally, the sugar crystals are stored and packaged. The sugar manufacturing process is a critical and complex operation that involves filtration which plays an important role in the manufacturing process of sugar, where the syrup, slurry, and gas will be filtered to remove microorganisms, dirt, and bacteria to make high-quality sugar. However, not all filters can be used randomly without having expert solutions. Filter Concept helps the sugar industry by selecting relevant filter solutions through their experts. Check back with Filter Concept for more updates. For any inquiries, please contact us at inquiry at the ratefilter-concept.com or bde at the ratefilter-concept.com. Thank you for watching Filter Concept.